Right fellas, for the third step in the easter egg, you'll be in the greenhouse. You're going to need a shield, and if you can get the Alistair Annihilation Wonder Weapon, it's going to be the best thing in the fucking world. It'll save your life, and it's the best weapon in the game. And if you don't know how to get that and the shield, my guides are in the description. So, come to the greenhouse and go upstairs, and all you do on this disc machine here where the wheel is, is press square to spin the wheel about four to five times, just keep on spamming it, and then you want to melee the wheel with your shield. And the wheel on the machine should look a bit fucked up like this. So once you've done that, you want to head downstairs and you can see this electric trap here. So, get your shield out and you want to run to the electric trap and you want to turn it on and as fast as you can, go into the electric with your shield and then you want to run as fast as you can up the stairs with the electrified shield and all you do is melee the telescope. And if you do it correctly, you will see a bright light on your screen and you've bossed it. If you are in co-op, all players in the game need to do this at the same time. So for co-op, someone turn on the trap and then everyone in the game with their shields out run to the electric trap and everyone run upstairs and melee the telescope at the same time. So once you've done that, a stone slab will appear down below. And if we interact with this, it's going to begin a lockdown process where you can't leave, you're locked in the greenhouse and you're going to be killing zombies, vampires and werewolves. But before you do this, make sure you are set with some good perks, a new shield, some silver bullets, and if you can, get the Alistair's Annihilator with full ammo on. It's the best thing in the world. So that's what I have in my game, and I'm going to show you my technique to complete this. So when everyone is ready in the game, come to the stone slab, and everyone needs to hold square on the stone slab for about 5 to 10 seconds, and then it will start the lockdown process. So basically all you need to do is kill off the zombies for the first 30 seconds or so. Kill them and then vampires and the massive werewolves will spawn. Here is my hoarding technique that worked out pretty well for killing the werewolves. So what I did was easier in solo because I couldn't run into any players but this is what I did. So I would hoard up downstairs first and then I would bring the horde and the werewolves towards the stairs. And then I would go up the stairs, turn around take a few pop shots and then I would turn around and go stand on the edge of the platform and then I would take a few more pop shots and then I would drop down when the werewolves got a bit too close and then when you jump down turn around and you can get some decent shots on the werewolves this time and all I do is just repeat that process you want to be using the charge shots from the annihilator they work best and also, if you do this hoarding technique, just watch out for the zombies jumping up that platform if you take too long. But as you can see, it's working pretty well for me. And all you do is kill off all the werewolves. And when you kill the last one, a bright light will appear on the screen. And now, you can go to the stone slab, press square to get a max ammo, and that is a lockdown step complete. 